All right, anglers, hey, we're back at it. This time, a little bit higher country and a little bit of ice off. It started, uh, so kind of a mid to upper elevation reservoir. And uh, behind me over here, lake is still completely uh, locked up. But we've got a couple hundred yards of open water right here, so we're gonna give it a shot and see if we can't catch a few fish on camera for you. Stay tuned. Every day till your dreams fade away Like a card never change Play the game that we say I need a break Time to stay strong Need to move on to be what I want I'll keep dreaming on Time to stay strong Need to move on to be what I want I'll keep dreaming on And just kind of pop it in Try to just give it a little bit of action. Oh, there he is. Nice. Not too bad, muddy down here. Just followed it all the way into the bank. Uh, black marabou jig. Yeah, it always seems to be the trick. <laughs> I did ice off. Yeah, black marabou. Beautiful fish. Yeah, it's a cut. Well, let's try and see if they want it faster. Possibly. <laughs> Maybe it's the opposite, right? We're like, hey, pelicans are here, there might be fish. And pelicans are like, hey, there's people here, there might be fish. <laughs> That's kind of funny. We think we're the smart ones. I feel safer letting it sink to the bottom over there than I do over here. And this is about 10 feet deep right through here. And it's still plenty deep, but I think it's because of the, the old dam. There's just a ton of boulders and rocks out there. There's a fish that keeps... Oh, there he is. <laughs> yeah, like three feet off the bank. <laughs> Finally. Come on. And he was so sluggish the way he picked that up, too. He's irritated now. He is now, but that was a sluggish strike. About the same size as the other one. Just pretty fish, though. Okay, what I'm doing is I'm just kind of casting towards that point. I'm gonna just bring it in that way. They're either hitting it 15, 20 feet out or they're hitting it right off this edge where it starts to like five feet out. Just keep your rod tip high. So when you get in close to the shore, just kind of hold your rod tip up and hesitate your jig a little bit. Just let it kind of hang there and slowly work in. Hey, I got one. Nice. Yeah, I just had a couple jump over there too, right where I was casting. See a good one? Ooh. Staying down too. 
Hold on. Ooh, look at that fish. That's a nice fish. Okay, watch your drag. I'm gonna say he's acting completely different. Let me see if I can get over here with you. Can you step that side just a little bit? Okay. Careful. Ooh. That's a nice fish. That's a big one. Keep him in the water. Look at that one. Let's get a picture. Yeah. That's every bit of four pounds, sweetie. You need the things. Okay. That might have been. Oh, I got another one. Yeah. I mean, he's not as good as that last one, but that one's going to be hard to beat today, you know? He was for a second. He's on now. Oh, pretty. Yep. Now the, the pelicans aren't going to leave me alone because I'm catching fish. Go away, boys. I need to catch fishy. Yeah. Oh, is he twisted? All right. Uh, yeah. Big cut underneath his gills there. That's nice. Pretty fish. I'll take a quick second and tell you kind of what we're using here. Classic quarter ounce black marabou jig and uh, I kind of rigged this with a 12 pound test fluorocarbon leader because there are other things in here that have teeth so <laughs> a little bit of bite protection there that's all it is pretty classic little leech pattern Yep, that water just started to warm just enough. They started getting hungry. There we go. Ooh. Little fighter. Almost acting like a rainbow. There we go. Starting to fire up a little bit. That's for sure. Oh, there he is. Is he on ya? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it feels like he's tangled in some line. Yeah. That's our first uh, rainbow. That's our first rainbow. Yeah. Beautiful rainbow. Nice. 
I can I like that's a cutthroat. There we go. He's nice. Beautiful cutthroat. Just shimmering. Colors. It's awesome. Here on the edge of the ice sheet. Wow, right here at the shore. Eh, uh, he's not. Yeah. I don't know, he's mad. He didn't want to come up. Um, I don't think so. It is? Oh, it is. I can see that now. Oh, he's light colored. Yeah. He's really a light colored tiger. Oh, that was a hit. Yeah, he's on it. He just picked that up on the fall. I didn't even think he had it. it doesn't feel as big as the others. Yeah, he's, about, oh, he's about the same. He just didn't have it very well. <laughs> Popped it out. You got it? Okay. Yeah, just reel it on nice and slow. Should have brought my fly rod. That ice is still pretty thick out there. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, they just started uh, biting just before you guys got here. Yeah, it was pretty slow this morning. As soon as the sun hit the water. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. We're not some energy fish. Man. Uh, nope, uh, black marabou jigs. There's a long one. Alright, there you have it. Uh, quite a few fish on camera. Ice off uh, conditions here. Um, mid to upper elevation lake and uh, quite a few fish. Awesome fishery. So can't say enough about it. Lots of cutthroat, uh, a couple of rainbows, one tiger trout, one really nice cutthroat. And uh, it's only going to last a couple of weeks and you can see the ice receding behind me. And uh, we're hiking out here for the day. So if you like our videos, like us on Facebook, like us on Instagram, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and as always, tie lines.